red Ooh. burgundy skirt on Kate, and she's got a new sweater. It's a it's a, a light lurex oh, sweater a with yeah. with just a little split sleeve at the bottom, little buttons going up the side. I mean, talk about mm. really comfortable holiday dressing. And I noticed that you couldn't resist but twirl a little in it. Yeah, it's a oh what this old thing. But I mean, it dances, it sits, it's uh. comfortable. You know, this is a skirt that you really can relax in. Well, and it's maybe tricky in and fall and winter to boots, wear the skirt. By the way. But yeah, you wear it with boots, yeah. right? So, and then if you're in that warmer climate, then you wear it with a, a little ballet flat, and you're good to go. And I mean, this is one that kind of just and presents again, itself. Look at that. Isn't it nice? And it has it has like a yoke at the top, so it's not full over the hips at all. And then it flares out, so you really. It's, it's one that you can go dancing in, you can cook in, you, you, you spill on it, you wash it in the washing machine. You know, it's not a big deal. It's not a big deal, but it is kind yeah. of a big deal. But isn't it pretty? Look at how like pretty this. that color is. I can't is. stop moving it because See, of what it you, does in the light. You know, we, we, we always, we make them upside down on the velvet, which means the dark side down because it's more slimming. But then when you sit, you see all these oh, glorious it. colors. <laughs> Look at how so pretty that good. is. Isn't that pretty? And actually just by looking at it, you get a sense of how soft well, it, it it's is. It's so regal and it's kind of like, I was watching a movie today uh, about the Renaissance uh. and, and, and you know, people were all dressed up in things like oh, this, yeah. but of course they probably wore it once and had to throw it out. They had to th but this, <laughs> this is the fabulous. Bordeaux Look is your color, color choice here. Isn't that gorgeous? Just showed you the purple, of course. And then, and then the, black, the black, of course. And the black doesn't, you know, it, you don't see as much reflection on the black. Well, but there's nothing more do. more beautiful than a black velvet skirt that you really can, you know, wear and sit in and have dinner and you're not going to hurt it. You're not going to hurt it. That's why Bob and I keep doing this for one, just because it's so gorgeous to look at, but also to show you how and far it, it velvet holds its has shape gone. has stretched to it. So it's really comfortable. Mm, that's really good. And then that, I love it when it's kind of slippery on the inside. It's probably best well, showing Usually colors. they are, and that makes them slide over your body perfectly. Or yeah. hosiery. Or, yeah, exactly. You know, tights if you're wearing those too, so that's going to be perfect for you. Let me give you lengths on this. 29 and a half to 30 and three quarters of an inch in our Missy sizes and plus sizes 31 to 31 and a half inch. I, I feel like now more than ever seeing more of these kind of midi length skirts and dresses well it's Just really you. it's really pretty for this time of year then you really can wear your tights and your boots mm -hmm. and and have that kind of russian princess look you know that that you're going to go out into the snow with dr Zhivago and have a hell of a good time wow you described my yesterday exactly <laughs> what i did bob how did you know yeah no, i was here <laughs> <laughs> i'm sorry did somebody just show me pockets show me these pockets um you oh, wouldn't I forgot we had I pockets. Too. I forgot all about that. Kate is here to save the day. And I, I'm always the first one to say, let's put a pocket in I, it. Trust me, I will be too. But we were going doing the tour and I'm like, yeah, it's just clean and simple. And Kate's like, here's their pocket. Well, you know, everybody, now, now that everybody walks around with their phone attached to their body or to their hand, it's nice to have a pocket to put it in. Are you one of the few that's still liberated from your cell phone? I, I don't I, have one. You don't have nope. a cell phone? Uh, nope, nope, dear. I don't do that. I say, no, I talk. Yeah. Joe has three cell phones. Yeah. But I like to talk to people and look them in the eye. And you go in the elevator in my building in New and York, everybody. and everybody's looking at their cell phone. They're, they're like afraid to look up because they I might, think, have, to, you know they might think, have to talk. I think it's an easy escape for introverts. Oh, I yeah. think so. Absolutely. Yeah. I, I agree. Well, I, I'm in awe and admiration of you for not having <laughs> a cell phone. But I do wish I had a Joe because then maybe I wouldn't. Well, he's, he's not right. always there, you know. <laughs> you, might, you might feel like he is sometimes. Well, no. <laughs> yeah, well, that's another story. <laughs> oh, wow. Um, once again, don't know how we got there, but hey. Oh, because of the pockets. That's right. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, I think, honestly, it's less about that for most gals, and we just kind of love the... It's like a little subtle shift in posture, I think, maybe, when you have your hands in your pocket. I don't, I don't know a woman that could really properly well, explain it, but we just do you, go. Do you, know, do you know, when I first went to work with Carol Burnett and I had to do an evening gown for her every, every year, uh -huh. every, not every year, every week on the show. Right, and course. she'd open the show and talk to everyone, looking lovely, and yes. then she'd change into funny outfits yes, after that. And she says, oh, could you give me pockets in my dresses? Because I don't know what to do with my hands. Yeah. 
So then she stood there, you know, with her hands in her pocket, looking chic and, and casual. Like a power pose, yeah. And, and it was fantastic because all her evening gowns had uh, pockets I in I love them. that story. Isn't that great? So actually, Bob does know. He totally gets it. Thank you, Carol. <laughs> because by unwittingly, you probably started that she decades did, ago. She did. Right? Oh, de you're right. Decades ago. Oh, isn't that incredible? 1967. I love listening to Bob's <laughs> stories of, of the amazing women that he's worked with. In fact, I wrote just some of them down, and I know the list is longer than yours. Oh, yeah? Carol Burnett. Yeah. Diane Carroll. Yeah. Bernadette Peters. Yeah. Diana Ross. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Have you heard of Cher? Oh, who? I don't know her last name. She's in Australia right now. Oh. Uh, Madonna. No. Elton John. Elton John. Well, he's not one of my ladies, but. Well, but, I know. I probably should have. But, but he wore fancier years. clothes than any of them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and that's just a few. I mean, isn't that incredible that we've got. And, and you're wearing pieces from that same designer with that same attention to detail, frankly, in your glorious life that I hope you're living as though it were a runway show. And I think that's great. No more perfect time to have a fantastic velvet skirt. But as while you're looking at it with, you know, other glorious pieces, I also want you to pair it with just a, a little t-shirt and a blazer. Why or, not? You know, Why not? A tank top and spring. Like clothes, clothes don't have specific they spaces they need to go to unless you're going in the in the river or something and <laughs> swimming. Well, that's true. But, but, you know, really and truly, clothes have changed. Yeah, and I think, well, women... And if they're not comfortable, they're, you shouldn't have them. It doesn't even make the cut. No. Right? All right, three color choices, the purple, the Bordeaux, and the black, $47.50. It is brand new today, only order of the entire year, A344692. So speaking of Kate's awesome sweater, that is also yes. brand new today. I love that sweater. Actually, Frank, I have a quick question for you. Will you let me know if we have like a little break of some sort coming up, because then I will change into my pick of the show. Okay, perfect. All right, so Colin.